I'm Heidi Hewitt, AutoCAD Technical Marketing Manager at Autodesk, and I'm here with Bill Fain, AutoCAD expert and author. Bill, we're talking about tool palettes. Do you have any best practices to offer users that want to share their tool palettes, their customized tool palettes, with others? Sharing tool palettes is, again, one of the hearts of uh, customizing. Standardization through customization, having developed a set of tool palettes that imply uh, help uh, compliance with your CAD standards, now you want to share them with your other users. Within an office, easy enough, if you go in through the Options command in AutoCAD and under the uh, Files tab, you dig down far enough in there and there is a path listed to where the uh, tool palette files live, the definition files. Find those files, copy them up to a file server, go to each machine in the office, change their path, the tool palette path, so that it finds those same palettes up on the file server. Make sure it's a read-only folder, or <laughs> palettes That's are so easy to change. Yeah. <laughs> right? If you like standards, you've got to lock things down. That's why I like standards, there's so many of them. <laughs> <laughs> So now you've got your uh, basic tool palettes up on the file server where everyone can share them, everyone's running to the same standards. One thing to remember is that if any of your tools include block insertions, those block insertions have to be available. The logical place to put them is that same folder up on the file server. So make sure those paths go right to the make sure proper the location. To the proper the location. Files. Maybe you want to send it to someone in a different office doesn't have access to your file server. Go to the palette that you want, right click, one of the options that comes up is export. And that exports that one single palette out of the total window. So if you have several palettes to export, you'll have to do each of them individually. Okay. At the other end, they simply, same thing, bring up any existing tool palette, right click, import. And it will now bring that, the new one in making sure you also send that person any block libraries that are necessary. Otherwise, it's like getting a drawing with references that you don't have the files for, Exactly, right? exactly. Okay, yep. good, great advice. Thanks, Bill.